In this video, we're going to be placing doors and windows on our building. So in order to do this, we need to make sure that our building already has walls mapped um, because windows and doors will attach to them. So we can't place them without walls already there. Um, all we need to do to place windows and doors is to come down to the wall features menu and we're going to select door to start. So you can see here that there's this ghost door attached to my cursor and that means it's ready to be placed. I'm going to zoom in to where I know a door is and I'm going to hover on top of the wall and you see it snaps to the wall and I'm going to click. Once I have my door placed, I can edit some of its attributes. For example, I can add a swing. I can change from single to double door if I want to. I can flip the direction of the swing, which I, I would need to here, and I can flip the hinge if I need to. It is worth noting that these features are mostly valuable when exporting your map into a file format, uh, because in 3D we don't represent the swing of the door, for example, or whether or not it's a double door. So it's just important to keep that in mind if you're going to spend the effort changing the attributes. Um, we can see here that this door is a little bit undersized, so we're going to click and drag on one of the nodes to bring it into size. We're going to repeat this process with windows. It is also worth noting that windows also don't show up on our 3D map right now. It's also for exports, so it's mainly for uh, safety PDFs. But if you do want to add windows to your building, you select the window tool, and then you hover on an existing wall just like we did with doors. So we're going to click and place, and if we want to edit uh, the window, we can choose the select tool, select the window, and drag its node out. So now it's properly sized. I'm going to repeat this process and create um, a bunch of windows and doors very quickly now. So I'm going to select the door tool. I'm going to zoom out a bit so I can see where all my doors are in this section. And I'm basically just going to hover on each wall and click where I know an entrance is. I'll hold spacebar and pan to bring more into view and continue placing doors. So you can see here, we've mapped about 10 doors in a very short period of time. We're going to do the same thing with windows. So again, I'm going to place, press spacebar and pan to bring some of them into focus. And I'm just going to continue placing windows. Okay, and this section is fully mapped with doors and windows. Um, it is worth noting I would need to come in here and adjust the size of these. Um, so I'll adjust the size of a couple of them. But otherwise, that's how to add windows and doors to your map.